Hi, many times while working on the MATLAB, we used to create the variable of symbolic type. And one of the advantages of the symbolic type mathematics is that we can easily create different type of function and we can easily find the expression out of them. Like Fourier transform expression, we can differentiate it, we can integrate it and so on. But many times it is also required to plot those function as a very against the some certain variables. Uh, then it uh, comes very typical to plot the symbolic variables uh, in uh, simple graphs. So in this particular video we will learn how to plot a symbolic variable uh, in a more convenient way for the user so that user can understand what is exactly being plotted there. So let's first define a symbolic variable like SYMST and then we will define a expression like sine 2 pi into t now if we look at the t it is a uh, sinusoid wave and we want to plot it so symbolic variable provides uh, there are certain uh, com uh, certain commands which provide a very helpful tool uh, uh, for plotting the symbolic uh, kind of expression and that is the ez plot ez plot and simply the expression name and then we will be able to uh, see the plot of that particular expression so uh, right now it uh, by default it is going from minus 6 to 6 if we want to increase the range or we want to decrease the range of the variable then we can also do that uh, through uh, minus 3 3 and now the expression uh, will look like the plot has been string to minus 3 to 3 range uh, by this we can simply easy plot let's take an, another example and let's first uh, refresh it like syms x and we define a variable uh, x to the power 2 plus sine of 2 pi and x so right now we can uh, uh, check the uh, um, plot of this through mathematics but that will be a uh, uh, typical task uh, through MATLAB we can easily uh, plot it simply by ez plot of y and the expression uh, will look like in this way so this is the expression of that particular uh, variable x square plus sin x and we can also increase the range let's see what happens when we increase the range y comma um, minus 10 to 10 and again because x square is creating a parabola so uh, still it will be nearly the same but uh, the variations which are occurring here that will be less variations as we go on the upper side we can uh, take a, another variable as well like uh, let's say sine square uh, sine 2 pi into x into sine 2 pi into x plus uh, cos 2 pi into x and let's plot it before let's close uh, all other windows and then is a plot of y so it is the um, function plot of that particular variable so it is obvious that it will not be easy to get this kind of plot by through simple calculations only we require certain mathematical tool and MATLAB provides um, very good mathematical tool for doing that so that's it for this video. Thank you.